Hey, what is up everybody? Yes, I am back once again on your phone, your computer, your TV, your tablet, your laptop. I don't know what you're watching me on right now, but welcome back. It's me, it's Malcolm, and today, today we are back with another reaction video because um, I just noticed that the Cut channel uploaded another episode of The Button. Um, I did react to one of these episodes like two months ago. Um, but of course I took that, uh, long hiatus, but, uh, I'm trying to be more consistent with these uploads. So I was, I figured, you know, it's, um, I think it's like one in the morning right now. So, um, recording this at one in the morning. That's why it looks a little bit darker back here, but, um, I'm really interested to see what this episode's about. So, um, without further ado, let's get into it. <laughs> Do I, can I like press it? You can't, it's not, it's not ready. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not doing it for you. Um. <laughs> Welcome. Well, damn. <laughs> and that, that's what we're doing, I guess. Okay. Um, what I've noticed about this, uh, this whole show, The Button, is uh, they edit it in a way that I think that it looks more dramatic than it is. Um, I think they do give the contestants like alcohol and stuff to like get them loosened up for the show. Um, not saying anything that I might see is okay or whatever, but um, I do notice that uh, that liquid courage does come out on the show. So, Welcome to the button, a speed dating show. When the button lights up red, either player may press it and swap out their date for a new person. Get out of here. If two people can last on a date for 10 minutes, they win an all expenses paid second date. This video is made in partnership with Lilo. Hi there. Good morning. I'm Sammy. It's Louis. Louis, nice to meet you. How are you? I'm doing well, how are you? I'm great. Fun fact about Louise. Okay. Uh, he has toes like fingers. Like you can grab with them? I can grab, I can pinch, That's I can open. So <laughs> can I see? Can you, okay, like, see okay. See if you can grab your glasses off your face. No. <laughs> I don't care if I'm in defeat. Maybe, maybe people are in the feet like that kind of stuff, but do not put your feet in my face. I don't know where you've been stepping. Um, don't know if you showered before you got in the studio. Uh, no, thank you. <laughs> but it seems like he's into it, so I don't know. He might be into this. I don't know if the other guy is. I think the other guy was kind of like weirded out that he, um, the guy with the glasses was uh, so interested in this. So I don't know. Oh, he's trying. Oh my God, he's still one in my eye. <laughs> Period. That's incredible. <laughs> so if we ever like tied mm. up or anything, just let me take my shoes off. You got your shoes. We'll get the fuck out of here. That's all we need. That's great. Are we gonna get tied up somewhere? How important is sex in a relationship? I think sex mm. is really important, but I, I don't think it's the end all be all. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. For me, it's, you're okay. I just don't think it's a date thing. Uh, Can I get a hug, though? Of course. You're beautiful teeth. I love you. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. It's nice to meet you. Oh, they're so nice. Okay. Wait, Louise, why did you reject them? I rejected them because it wasn't a vibe. It was a conversation like job. It was like, I don't know, I got a job. Hey. Hi. I'm here. Good morning. Good morning, Thanks, Louise. Louise. How are you? Good. Good. How kinky are you? Kinky? Yeah. <laughs> First question. Hey, I know we just met, but, uh... You like being tied up? <laughs> um, I think when I was on a dating app, when I was dating, um, I think a girl, like, she hit me up in the DM or something. Uh, and she said something about, like, she wanted to see me naked. Like, that was the first, like, one of the first interactions I had with her. And I was like, all right, that's a little bit weird, but I'm into it. Um, obviously, it didn't work out. I'm with somebody else now, so... Uh, yeah, so uh, I don't know if they were only into me for my body, but uh, it was giving that. So. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll do nothing with feet. Don't get confused with the feet tricks. <laughs> Not th don't give me the replay, bro. Nothing with feet, Um, but what are you good at? I could eat ass pretty well. Oh, Sexually, okay. I'm just saying. Just saying. Salad. Yeah, okay, that's, that's a plus. That's a plus. Yeah. I got to be. Am I gonna get age restricted or should I censor that? <laughs> well, they, it's not age restricted for them, so I guess it wouldn't be for me, but um, 
Oh. Right. Big booty. Oh, it's big. Okay. So if you don't got experience with big booties, you gotta, you gotta move it out the way. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I could show you later. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Have you ever used sex toys? Oh, absolutely. Really? Easily. Yeah. Okay, what kind? Okay, most often I use is probably cock ring. Cock ring? Yeah. I get cold really easily. Yeah. So it shrinks up. Okay. Or like when I'm out in the bars. Mm -hmm. Wait, so you wear it also besides sex? Yeah. On your free time? No, not like always. Oh, you like, just turn it on like me. <laughs> <laughs> like at work. <laughs> yeah. It just feels good. Okay. Yeah. That's cute. Yeah. He's not into I'm that. Sorry. What kind of vibe are you feeling? Like, what do you want? Um, it's an instant connection. If I get shy, I know I like you. <laughs> and for me, it was like more of like a nervous shy, but it wasn't like, a, oh my god. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Eric. Okay. See you later. Louise. I'm sorry. They were like good. Oh, thanks. Oh, You're just like tatted. Thank you. I have zero <laughs> tattoos. Zero? Zero. You look like you have tattoos. Have you ever used sex toys? Well, I personally used um, like a plug and then I've also used a flashlight before. Okay. I've used a flashlight. I've never tried anything. <laughs> but I'm open. I never said no to anything I've never tried before. All right. Do you remember what was my name? You don't remember what I am? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? You know what though? Fair, because he was like, "Do you even remember my my name?" And I think it was like what thirty seconds to a minute. It's like, you don't remember my name? Okay, I'm just gonna hit this, hit the button. Thank you for your time. <laughs> Lewis was cool though. He seems like a chill dude. I would definitely like hang out with him at a bar. He's definitely chill. Sucks he couldn't find a date though, because I feel like he was definitely like. What do you what do you call it um, when you're put to uh, like stir things up? Uh, I feel like he was a plant. Um, I think he was like one of just like one of the plants in the beginning because the the producers knew he was not gonna find anybody here, so they were just like, oh, let's just spice it up with it. Of it. This is a very spicy episode, by the way. So yeah. Damn. I like your style. Thank you, thank you. Yes, I, I love me some street style. Yeah, That's yeah. That's my yeah. vibe. Kind of like urban, yeah. yeah, do, you, yeah. Do, do you dance? I don't. <laughs> do you dance? He urban? looks like a dancer. I do, yeah. I did hip hop dance for uh, a number of years. I've been on some cruise oh, and stuff, yeah. Cool. So, like, he's gonna show something, right? He's gonna show a dance. Okay. <laughs> As someone who loves dance, um, whenever. You know what's funny? One of the things I hate doing is telling people I like to dance or I'm a dancer. Uh, I haven't danced in years, like competitively or whatever, but um, anytime I say like I dance or whatever, but one of the first things they do, and it always annoys me, is show me a move. And I'm just kind of like, dude, I'm not a toy. I'm not something you I dub. And it was just kind of like, I don't know how he's gonna feel about that, but anytime somebody hits me up with like a, show me a dance move, let me just create a beat for you. I'm just kind of looking at them like, can we not do that and say we did? So. Yes, he is. <laughs> well, you did the little slap. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh okay. my lord. Hey. Did I get your name? Danny. Danny, Danny, Danny. Andrew. Cool, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The name thing, so What? Sorry, you're really cool. I, um... I, you, I feel like... like a friendly thing. Yeah, exactly. Like, I, I could thing. hang with you all day. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. we were we were vibing for yeah. sure. And yeah, so, it yeah, was a vibe. Sure. Yeah, thank you so much for yes. coming. Really appreciate it. Likewise. Everybody's so thank nice. You, I love it. Thank you. He was nice, though. He was cool. He's a sweetie. He's yeah. a sweetie. Yeah. He's gonna find love, I'm sure. Hi. Hi. I'm Andrew. I'm Trey, nice to meet you. Trey, nice to meet you, Trey. That is a really cool shirt. Thank you. <laughs> Do I, can I like press it? You can't, it's not, it's not right. Uh, oh, it was, it was just like that. He just sat down and said, no, thank you. Oh, I thought it was a completely different thing where they were talking and then he hit the button, but he just sat down and he said, the vibes are not there. No, thank you. Let me hit next, please. Yikes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not doing it for you. Not to say this being rude, but a little color, like, 
uh, like, like I'm too white for you. <laughs> a little like chocolate, you know. Oh. Something low. Mm. Tan. Oh. Okay. I'll get a get tan. <laughs> You're awesome. Question: How important is sex in a relationship? <laughs> oh, let me just be quiet. It's important. I mean, for me, um, I'm endowed, so to have somebody that's able to accommodate that has been an issue here. Trey, yeah. how much experience do you have? Mm, with a little kiss here and there. Oh, that, like that's it? Yeah. Okay. Oh, you asked oh. Trey if he's a virgin. Let's not do that. I feel that that is not something <laughs> Um, we should be asking on a YouTube video. I feel like if Trey's a virgin, we don't, that's not our business, but, um, uh, mm. <laughs> Ooh. Trey. Don't ask me that. <laughs> I'll take, I'm a virgin in my ass. Wait. Huh? I'm a top. So... I've never been. Oh, oh okay. I was, gotcha. like, okay. <laughs> I was, I was like, huh? Yeah, I'm a virgin. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Can I ask how old you are? Nothing wrong with it. I'm 21. I just turned 21. Ooh. Right, how old are you? 35. Okay. Um, Whoa. You're like. Could too old. No, you're not oh. too old. You're just giving like. Go ahead. You're like. <laughs> <laughs> you're, like <laughs> you're like my uncle. Like. No, like you give uh, me like uncle vibes. Like. I look like a Wait. whole lesbian up here, and I gave you Stop. all the <laughs> you know, like, What kind of <laughs> shit is that? <laughs> Can I, I'm gonna close my eyes. I like it. Hi. Hello. How are you? <laughs> oh, no. It's, in the, it's a you? white boy. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. He's not into I have a question it. for you. What? Tell me about your worst first date you've ever had. So, I never had a first date before. What? what? So, this is the first time you've ever, like, gone on, like, a, like a date kind of thing? This, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. <laughs> that scared the hell out of me. Um, that was so. That was probably the most aggressive slap I've seen on this channel. I don't know what his turn off was, but I knew what his turn off was, and I thought. Trey was going to hit the button on him, but, um, I think, I think what this guy's going to say is, uh, I need someone with, like, someone with experience. Like, I don't want to, uh, have to, you know, give somebody the ropes on, you know, anything. I want somebody that's like ready to go. I don't, I don't know. But, um, that was really aggressive. That made me uncomfortable. Hello. Oh, how's it going? Good. How are you? Good. Oh, he didn't, Jared. He didn't say why or nice anything. Okay. Sure. Fun fact about Jared. Okay. His tongue is incredibly flexible. <laughs> what does that mean? I can just make it really big. Oh, oh my God. cool. What the fuck? How are you doing that? That's <laughs> dope. Jared won. Why did you reject me? I felt like we had a good conversation. I just felt us being more like friendly than anything serious. Work. What's your name? Zach. I'm, I'm Jared. Nice you are very you. cute. Thank you. You as well. I <laughs> so I love how old shirt. are you? 26. 26, okay. How old are you? 22. Damn. Okay. Let's talk about your piercings. Yeah, I have like 11. So I have these two. The two right here. And then I also have my nipples pierced. But obviously, you can't see You were so cute, dude. <laughs> Ask if he'll show you his nipple piercings. Should I? <laughs> I'll show you one of them. You want to see one? Yes. Swoon. <laughs> would you ever get your penis pierced? Ooh, huh? Would you? Never. No. Yeah. There's no way. I'm yeah, sorry. I can tell you. It's okay. You know, I really think our conversation was great. It was like going really well, but I feel like we vibed too well as like friends. I don't know if I could see it going in like a romantic direction. Yeah. Yes. That was a good conversation. It was a very good conversation. Yes. Yes. It's very nice to meet you. Oh. Hi. How you doing? Good, how are you? Doing well. What's your name? Uh, Gary, what's your name? Jared. Jared, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Have either one of you used sex toys before? Oh. Have you? Yeah, yeah. I have. I mean, a few times. Have sure. you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a cock ring, maybe? Or like anything to do with like... 
like the dick, I guess. So not butt stuff. Not butt stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm, um, okay. Yeah. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> You're so good. Can I ask why? Um, uh, you can. Um, you don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Uh, it's okay. <laughs> no, I won't tell you. I'm so sorry. No, you're good. <laughs> you're, you're really nice, though. Thank you, you yeah, too. Yeah. It's very nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Gary, what's your name? Gary, I'm Curtis. Hi, Curtis. Hi, Love you your too. nails. Thank you. I Love your nails. Well, thank you. Yeah. That's cute. <laughs> sorry. I can't. <laughs> Wow. I'm not trying to be mean, but like, what the fuck was that? That's who you're gonna pair me up with? Give me a sexy daddy. Hi. Hi. I'm Chris. Chris, I'm Curtis. Nice to meet you. Chris is my dad's name, by the way. Oh, cool. Yeah. Cool. Oh, that's How important off. is sex in a relationship? I wouldn't say it's like the most important thing, but like, we all have. Yeah. <laughs> I'm cool. sorry. Yeah, no worries. Okay, I'm gonna be nice. Ugh, my butthole is quivering. What? Hi. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. How's it? Oh! They brought him back again. Okay, cool. Let's see how this is going to work. Oh, man. Um, We're near the end of the video, so either this works out or it doesn't. So, I'm leaning on the side of nothing's going to work out in this episode, only because... Like, it seems like every guy is saying the same thing. It's like, you know, you feel more like, more like a friend to me. I just really see you as a friend, which isn't a bad thing. It's just like, I get it. Because like, if you're vibing with someone so well, um, it's kind of hard to be like, oh, I could date this person, which I understand. I understand. We've been out here. Um, it's been questionable. Why? Not a whole lot of great options. It's <laughs> slim pickings here in Seattle, I guess. Sure is, you know, a single gay guys. Not a lot of them. No, no. Where are you at dating wise right now? I would say I'm ready for a relationship. I like to take things maybe a little slower. Like if we can go out for a few times and we're just vibing, the more and more that we go along, I feel like it'll naturally form into Correct. something. Okay, good. How do you feel about it? That's where I'm at. If I had fun with you, let's hang out again. If we had fun that time, let's hang out again. Let it happen organically. How important is sex in a relationship, boy? Sex is important. It's, yeah, <laughs> no, there's no beating around the bush in that one. I'm not gonna settle down with someone when intimacy is lacking. We can't even fake that. No, not at all. Are you too open to sexual exploration? Yeah, I'd say I'm not boring, but I'm also like not super crazy, you know, like I'm not gonna be like, yeah, take this 10 inch like huge thing and like just go for I'm it. not gonna shove a 10 inch of anything <laughs> up anywhere on you. Um, <laughs> the biggest part is like making sure each other is like comfortable with it and having fun with it. Oh, 100%. Okay, you two look cute together. I'm gonna go red again. If you're not vibing, get me. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> I'm gonna call that a match. Congratulations, you two are going on wow. a second date. All right, so that was another episode of The Button. Um, I think there was another episode that I didn't watch that featured uh, only women. And then of course, now this is feature only men, uh, featuring only men. I really, for some reason, this felt really wholesome when the guys were rejecting each other. Cause it wasn't just like, it wasn't, none of them were really rude about anything. They were just kind of like, look, you seem more like a friend. Um, uh, one of them was like, look, you remind me of my uncle. You give me uncle vibes. Also, there was like that age gap, and I know, I think his name was uh, Trey, um, that said it wasn't a big deal. But when you say things like, oh, you remind me of my uncle, I mean, it, like, it, how do I say it? Um, it feels like you are saying that age does matter to you. Um, the energy in this video was kind of great i enjoyed the different dynamics um i really didn't think the last couple was going to match i thought the guy on the left was just gonna be like no thank you at the end um 
But then they brought the other guy back and I was just kind of like, okay, maybe the producer saw something here that um, that it's gonna work out. So of course it worked out, they're going on a second date. Um, hope it turns out well for them. I didn't know they were in, I didn't know that this show was in Seattle. I thought, I don't know why, maybe just because I'm so used to YouTube being in California. I thought this was like LA, like, and like, yeah, I definitely just thought this was like in Los Angeles, filmed in Los Angeles, um, but Seattle, wow. Um, that definitely, uh, wow, that's pretty cool. Um, especially one of them bringing up the, uh, that, uh, like the gay scene, it's not really a lot of people out there. So I really think it's cool that they brought, um, a lot of members of the LGBTQ community in like one place to like speed date and see like who they're feeling, who they're not feeling. I did like that. I really, I really think that's cool. Um, I'm so glad I'm taken because speed dating looks like hell. <laughs> it definitely looks like something I could not do. And for people to do it on camera, I I don't know. I could not do that. But um, another entertaining episode of The Button. Once again, it is Malcolm. That's me. Um, tr again, trying to keep it uh, consistent with these uploads. It's probably going to be a lot of reaction videos here and there because... Um, there's a lot of stuff on YouTube that I've always wanted to watch and commentate on. I just haven't had the chance to, but now I do. Um, so once again, it is Malcolm, that's me. I hope you had a good time. I hope you liked, shared, and subscribed. Um, tell me what you want to see next on this channel. Um, without further ado, I wish you good well. I wish you well. I wish you good health. And I will see you again next time.